is an Extreme Rules match. Introducing first, the WWE Champion, The Undertaker. In the history of professional wrestling business, that's probably one of the best entrances I've ever seen. And no doubt at all, it does give you a rush. I still have some of the old tapings from Raw, uh, like the full episodes. And I watch them from time to time. And if I, watch it go, if I go back and watch it from 97, I used to remember whenever they came out. Uh, that's actually when I started watching our WWF. WWF. I didn't say WWE, WWF. When I used to watch it, it was so much fun. And whenever they kicked off Raw, it really gives you a rush, no doubt at all. And um, right now, at the moment, what you're seeing right now, me playing as Animal. I think I was playing as, as Animal. And we are going against the team of Undertaker and Kane. You can say another one of the greatest tag team in the history. Not one of the best, but uh, I mean, look at the names The Undertaker and Kane. Come on now, they're the Brothers of Destruction. They have been, uh, uh, been an attitude error, they've made their name, and The Undertaker is simply a legend. He's been a legend since forever. And I think, uh, if you're if you uh, if you're watching Raw at the moment these days. As you guys can see, they've been uh, releasing some promos regarding Kane returning again as uh, Masked Kane. Who knows? Nobody knows yet. Uh, there are some hints that they're giving us. He had uh, he was wearing uh, his old glove. If you go back, watch it carefully. See, I mean, see, that's a good thing. You watch my videos because you get some hints. But uh, if you go back, watch it. Uh, the first promo. You can see uh, he breaks the glass or something with his old glove. You can see it clearly. But I don't know if he's going to come back as Mass Kane. Who knows? I mean, quite frankly, I don't know. Um, well, they certainly gave him a title run already. Uh, I don't know if he's going to be a champion again before he retires. Uh, Kane said he had uh, two years, from two to three years of maximum left in him. Uh, that was uh, last year when he said that, so I think this might be his last run, and also probably Undertaker's gonna go out too. Who knows? The legend of Undertaker keeps going on and on. Taker hasn't never said that. You know, he's just gonna retire out of nowhere. He's just gonna do his thing at WrestleMania, which that that's the only thing that I like. And I don't think he needs to come out very often like he used to, anyways. But uh, that's it for the match. I just won the match. 
Uh, wow, it was awesome to see both of them pin Undertaker and Kane at the same time. But uh, anyways, enough talking about Undertaker and Kane. These two legends, oh my gosh, they were amazing. Um, uh, rest in peace to uh, Hawk, who died back in 2003 from a heart attack. I think he was uh, taking a nap. Uh, good old fellow fell asleep and uh, didn't wake up. His wife tried to wake him up. But uh, here, here are some other legends um, that's going to go down in the history as... I mean, they've already been in Hall of Fame for sure. And uh, if you guys want me to post some other, another awesome match uh, with, with some legends in it, let me know. I wish there was Chris Benoit. Rest in peace to him too. Such a good wrestler. Uh, he's been given a really bad name. But uh, who knows? Someday maybe everybody's going to forget about it. But oh well. See you guys.